the mental health and wellness of our community and an incredible story surrounding this small tattoo. A local waitress wears the semicolon tattoo on her wrist, symbolizing solidarity against suicide. And as 7 Eyewitness News senior reporter Eileen Buckley shows us, she just received an act of kindness that melted her heart. 28-year-old Katie Battelle and Brett Ransom truly highlight the meaning of the word serendipity, something that happens by chance in a positive way. Friday night was a routine night for Battelle as she waited tables at Sado in Buffalo's Elmwood Village. Ransom and his wife were at one of her tables, but Battelle didn't realize Ransom spotted her semicolon tattoo on her wrist. For nearly a decade, this symbol has been used to show solidarity against suicide and other mental health issues. Issues. Anybody who's struggling with mental health, I think it's just great to know that there is somebody, whether you know it or not, who appreciates you being here. That's when Ransom decided to write a note on his dinner bill. We noticed your semicolon tattoo. We're glad that you're still here and that you helped us, helped us have a great meal. Thanks. It is probably out of most people's comfort zone, and I, and I think mine as well sometimes. Battelle shared with me that when she was 21, she tried to take her own life. She still copes with depression, anxiety, and panic disorder. What Brett actually doesn't know was the night before, uh, I had confided in one of my friends, and I told her, I was like, I'm having those thoughts again. Like... The timing of his note took on an even stronger meaning. It was just like a sign from the universe or something like, hey girl, we know you're going through it again, but here you go. Here's a little boost to help you keep going. As May is Mental Health Awareness Month, let this be a reminder that a little compassion can go a long way in helping someone's mental well-being. Melinda Dubois is executive director of the Mental Health Advocates of Western New York. And if we all did more of that, we would be creating such a wonderful um, spirit and positivity in the world. I felt compelled to say something and, and did, and I'm glad I did. Battelle posted a short and tearful message on Twitter, and she's received a massive response. She says she has more than 300,000 likes on her Twitter account and an explosion of reaction on Instagram as well. And if me sharing my journey can help anyone, at least just one person, know that, you know, you're not the only one who feels this way, but... We still need you here. <laughs> In Buffalo, Eileen Buckley, 7 Eyewitness News. Wow, what a powerful story. And, and we thank her for sharing her story. The smallest act of kindness can go such a long way. That and the reminder that dialogue is so important is the message of that story. If you ever need help, there is always someone to talk to. You can call Erie County Crisis Services at 834-3131 or Niagara County Services at 285-3515.